All right, guys, welcome into episode number 13 of the trilogy series. If you haven't watched so far in this series, we're going for all three boss drop logs from ED 1, 2, and 3. We've done 60 runs so far, and we'll do 61 through 65 on this episode. You can see the loot breakdown to the left. We've made 2.3 bill so far. Um, but if you look at the chest as of right now, it's 1.73 bill. And as of the recording last episode, it was 1.78. So we're 50 mil behind to start with. So we might not make that much loot in this episode, but keep an eye out for the drops on ED2 because the giveaway at the end are the average energy drops from ED2 Plus, I will add 10 mil if we see a broadcast from any of the three bosses. So keep an eye out for that. And without further ado, let's roll the clips. All right, doing a solo run. Hopefully got that. Whew, just barely got it. Uh, four scales, unfortunately. Trying to do a solo so that I can get a little bit of value before I start doing duos. Uh, but unfortunately, it didn't work that time. So hopefully on ED2, it does. All right, ED2 solo, hopefully a big energy drop. <laughs> no, five. Oh, just five energies. That's not gonna good. That's not gonna be good for the overall average energy drop on this episode. Hmm. All right, not great here, but we got the drop. A regular elite chest, 41 huge blunt rune salvages and 51 blackstone air tips. So not a great run even being a solo, so maybe duo runs will be a little bit better, but we'll see. All right, we almost got the one cycle. We got Crixus back again. Hopefully he brings us some good luck. He was refusing to do anything with me, but he's back for this trilogy, so hopefully we get some big drops. No whammies. Eight, I think. Yeah, eight for me. Heck yeah, I'll take eight. I'm not sure what he got, but maybe he'll tell us. Eight for him as well. Not bad. Well, Mr. Cricket was trying to die for a second there, but hey, mine got 36 energies. That's good for the uh, the giveaway on this episode, which is the average uh, energy drop. So 36, That's uh, that might actually be the best yet. Let me see. Yeah, one one best. Nice, we'll take it. All right, since Mr. Crixus has been so kind and gave us some good RNG, I'm going to just skip this boss fight for him, and we're just going to use this depth touch start. So wish us both luck. Let's do this. Oh, nothing. That's a bummer, but trilogy done. The drop, blood, black dragon height, four blackstone hearts in an elite chest. So nothing for me. Nice, personal record of one minute and 24 seconds. Doing a run with E-Girls here, and he just absolutely crushed that. I was just watching, uh, but I got three scales. Nice, personal record, 0.6 seconds. No drop. We got the one cycle. Easy kill. This guy is crushing it. E-Girls, you're the man. One minute, 15 second personal best, and four energies. Not a great drop, but a great kill. This is probably the fastest trilogy I've ever done. E-Girls, HMU, carried me all the way to not a drop, and actually not a PR on that one, but the fastest overall trilogy by far. Uh, not, <laughs> not much there, elite chest, battle staffs, but, but yeah. Thanks again for the carry. That was that was super quick. All right. Well, after that super fast run, me and E Girls HMU or Hit 'Em Up, I guess, are going to run a timed run to try to beat our current, my current best, I guess, at 48 minutes. So we'll start the clock and we will run this trilogy. Come on, get it. Come on. Nice. Not a PR. Two scales. So really bad but we're only 11 minutes in, so 
crushed in the time, the timed run. All right, we're halfway through ED2 and we are at 18 minutes. Come on, go, 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 go. Nice, ED2 done. Six energies and we are 22 minutes and 30 seconds in. So absolutely crushing it. Holy crit, just crushed probably my POV. Oh my gosh, 23 seconds and a 34 minute run. Jeez, he, he was getting crits galore. I was just there for the ride. The drop, Ghostly Essence, Elite Chest, five Blackstone Hearts. Another bad drop, but man, that was, that was so quick. Last run of this episode, we're doing it with Never Zami. We were 24K off of a, a one cycle, but we'll knock it out here. A little bit slower, three scales, did it double? Nope, just three. Bummer, but not the best run. I died on Sanctum Guardian, but we'll keep at it. Hopefully the next one is a little bit better. All right, we'll get the kill here. Almost got the skip, 30,000 away. There's the last ED2 run of this episode and we got 12 energies. So overall pretty good actually, uh, not gonna lie. We'll take that, especially since the drop for this episode of the giveaway was average energies. So pretty good. All right, final run of this episode. About to get the kill. That's our hundredth ambassador kill. No drop there for either of us. 21 Blackstone Heart, or 20, 121 Black Dragon Hide, Elite Chest, and some arrow tips. So not great, but we got the run. All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up for episode number 13 of the trilogy series. We have now completed 65 total trilogy runs. Unfortunately, no new log progression on this episode, but we did, however, get a new max energy drop of 36, which was one better of our previous best. So that's pretty good. And we also crushed our my duo PB timed run of 34 minutes and 15 seconds. So special shout out to eGirls for running two runs with me. Uh, and then a shout out to Crixus and Never Zami for also doing a duo trilogy run. So thanks again. If I didn't get to do one with you this time, leave a comment saying that you want to do one with me or just shoot me a message in game. I'm usually down to do a trilogy, um, but just leave a message and let me know that you're, you're interested. Uh, let's get into this loot breakdown. Uh, the chest value almost stayed the same since last episode. Nothing new to add. Uh, 1.768 bill still in here, which I think is actually less than what it was to start this trilogy series uh, episode. And then the bank value is minus the 500 mil for that is 525 mil. So the loot breakdown is actually kind of funny. We made negative 11 mil for doing five trilogy runs with a personal best uh, drop at ED2. So pretty unfortunate. Uh, that's just how it goes when the scale value drops by 200k per scale and I have 750 or something like that in the chest. So we didn't make any money. We lost 11 mil uh, and it brought down our total GP per run to 35.3 mil per run, which still is pretty good. We'll take it, but I'm about to lose a little bit more GP because the giveaway on this one was the average energy drop plus broadcasts, which we didn't get any. So the average energy drop was 12.6. We'll round up to 13. So if you left your name in the comments in the last video, you've been entered in to win 13 energies. So without further ado, let's spin this wheel. All right, good luck, good luck, good luck, guys. No whammies. Sixing, you've won the giveaway. Now, I'm not sure if you posted because you wanted to enter the giveaway or do uh, duo runs with me, but if you don't want the 13 energies, uh, just shoot me a message. I'll carry it over. Speedy19 still hasn't collected his from last episode, so Speedy19, let me know if you want to carry your energy or your scale uh, giveaway over. 
and we'll just have one big loot for someone who who wants it but if you want it shoot me a message uh and i'll meet up you with you and i'll give you the loot and maybe we can do some runs together but if you like this video uh please consider liking subscribing leave a comment we're not going to do a giveaway in this next episode coming up because i made negative 11 mil so we'll wait till the next episode to do a giveaway but Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Uh, hopefully I can run more duos with more people, but until next time, have a great day.